Senator Vargas, uh, you said Thursday that you do not support abortion up until birth, but in the past you have often deferred when pressed about where you draw the line. So your opponent has said that your opposition to restrictions amounts to support of abortion on demand. How far into a pregnancy or under what circumstances, if any, do you feel that abortion should not be an option? Thank you very much. Look, I'm against abortion on demand and against abortion up until birth. And I did say that in the last debate, Congressman Bacon, but the reason why this is really an important issue on behalf of women in this district is he's trying to hide his position on this. He's been trying to hide his long-held position. He has co-sponsored the most aggressive abortion ban in this country and had been the original co-sponsor of the bill. It would have punished women and it would have criminalized doctors. It had no exceptions for the life of the mother, rape or incest in this bill. And he has been on national TV doing everything he can, talking about, I will support a national abortion ban. He's trying to hide his stance because he is out of step with voters. And he continues to try to ride this and be seen like he's moderate on this issue because he's afraid. At the end of the day, women deserve to know on this issue that you want to make decisions on their behalf. You believe as an elected official, you should be making decisions on behalf of women. I believe that that decision needs to stay between a women and their doctors. Because even though you've been publicly supporting the Texas abortion ban, and even want an abortion ban in the Constitution, you can't hide from your own words that you have stated on this issue.